Hey guys, Average Homeowner here. Hey, today's project is an electrical outlet. Hey, let me explain. I want to run these lights, string them, you know, like across the lanai here, like here, 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 across the lanai, right? So I need an electrical outlet for them. Now, <clears throat> once again, I've never worked with concrete before, so I'm just winging it. I'm not winging it. I talked to some people, especially my electrician buddy, who told me how to take these pot lights out. You just take this out, unscrew the light bulb, take this out, there's a couple little screws, and the pot becomes loose, and then you push it up, and then the cool thing, he says, is put the light bulb back in and turn the switch on, and then you got light up there, and you can see I got light up there. Okay, so now I wanted to run this wire. That's all open up there. I wanted to run it and put an outlet right here, okay? You got the air conditioning going on now, but you can see I already cut for the box, but that was different because here's what I cut out. This big hunk of cement in between this metal lath. All right, so what did I do? I used my uh, cement cutting blade on my grinder for most of it, and then I finished it off with a multi-purpose blade on this. Cut that out, I will pop this in, put the outlet in it, and then the neat thing is I'll run it from there and I'm only using this as a chase because here was a fan and a fan that's supposed to have a light on it if you wanted to. So there's a switch inside. I didn't have the light, so I didn't hook the light up. So I'll bring this wire back over to there. It'll already be hooked to the switch that's in the house. Bada boom, I'll have a switch. I'll hang the lights. Beautiful. So I thought I should show you this. So this is a called a old, old work box, not a new one. And see these little flangey things here? When you tighten the screw down, they'll tighten down. So basically you make the hole, pop this in the hole, tighten those, tighten those screws down, and there you go. You got an outlet box up there. Box is in, if you can see a little gray there, that's just some um, concrete patch because I sliced through uh, with the grinder a little bit. It's just a hard spot to get into, but uh, good as new. Here's the, see that ready mix concrete patch, really nice. Goes in easy, fixes stuff, fine. This part is done. I threw an outside cover on it too, just to clean it up. Even though it's under cover, it'll just be, I had it. So I threw it up. Yep. The wire through the ceiling, I'm using this product. That's a fancy name for a fish or a snake, but keep screwing one end into the other making it longer and longer. I have three of them in there. From that hole, I should be able to grab it. And then I'll just tape the wire to the end and pull it back this way. So I was easily able to find it. And I'm gonna attach the wire to it. So it's as easy as pulling it through. There's my wire. And I will uh, cut this and attach it. Wiring wise, green or cop, copper, plain to, that's your ground. Here is our red wire that would have lit the light that would have been on here if I chose to do it. So that's on a switch inside. Common is white, white to white, black to black. That's the one for the fan that's on another light switch. So now wiring it this way, the light switch inside will work the outlet and it'll turn on the lights. All right, there it is, plugged in there. And you can see them flip down the lanai. So yeah. Tonight I'm gonna to be enjoying the new patio lights. This is the average homeowner, till the next time.